Yeah. And diversity too, which I don't like a lot. Yeah, same here. I don't like seeing them with the same characters. Even though Darkseid has been a dominant force, but we haven't seen him in uh, the last two weeks anyway, so it's, it's nice to see some more Darkseid action. Yeah. Alright, so we got Grand Finals, so remember guys, uh, it's 3 out of 5, the loser side does have to win through 3 out of 5 twice, so... I'm taking the upgrade. Begin. Alright, here we go. Dark side able to start it up. Catches oh, them early. Ooh. Damage right now. Able to trade. My wake up's working out pretty well for uh, Vengeance so far. Hey, hold it, is it? Dodge. It's caught by the boot though. Don't ever. Tied up. Be impatient. This is the annoying part about Dark Side. He's gonna help you with Mega Beams. But waiting for a teleport once you get uh, close to him is really kind of when you get your time in. Right now it's pretty good damage here. Wait for the wake up this time. That low is so good. Oh, good pack dash. Oh, but it's... Oh, wow. Auto correct? Another one? That was. I'm trying to make sure he doesn't, he doesn't flash. Yeah, Both have bar. It's a bit rough here because the dark side has these two bars. I got one, but he's just building have, up meter. Yeah, it's crazy how much meter he builds off of that right now. Well, there we go. It should be it. Didn't want to clash. Oh, so. This is done. This is going to go to wow. overhead. Try to get in. Dark side wins. <laughs> Vengeance, he's uh, been pretty much zoning the entire time since he started this match. I mean, sorry to get out of the tournament this week. And so far, has gotten them all the way through to the being two finals. two games away from winning. This is going to be a bit rough here, but uh, Henny Savage has to get in. Go for the character he's using right now, so we'll have to see if we can make that kind of uh, adjustment on the fly. Dark side. Woman. You played it when the game. Yeah, you know, I mean, no, I mean, like Dark Side is this kind of character. I mean, this is what he is. Yeah. The so, playing um, that part of playing this matchup is playing patient. You have to play patient. Begin. It just comes with the territory in this game. Oh, nice start off here. So we'll see, like, see, the thing is that he goes for a wake-up teleport here. And so we'll have to see if Hanny Savage is going to make an adjustment there or not. Once he's full of screen... How does he... Does he have a cheat code to keep getting this stage, though? Well, I mean, uh... Savage won the first one, so... Oh, you did. I'm right. Oh, uh, just back to you again. Some claws, though. I've never seen somebody get the stage they want this many times, though. That's funny. Well, okay, you can probably get out of that, the shimmy. Oh! It was like low cross-ins are really, really uh, cutting people up right now. But I think that yeah. the Savage... 
Uh, he did a really good job of blocking the overhead and the jumping. Nice dodge. Exactly. Nice in there. Jumping. This is a trait. Trait. Oh, it gets the cross up. This is going to be Dark crucial here. Control you. I can't be tamed. Alright. Alright, so at least that bar is gone now. Get one back. Right, handy getting uh, those. Uh... Oh, there it is. No clash available. So Handy has some work cut up against him, but looks like he's trying to make strides to it. Yeah, this is an uphill battle for sure, um, but it is doable, especially since uh, Raiden is so relying on zoning right now with uh, his hopeless playstyle and the character. Uh, once he kind of you know starts using more of those mid-screen uh, combo options, Can't it becomes really predictable eventually. So Handy Savage has an opportunity here to kind of keep it going. It is a long way to go, though. Uh, so Handy Savage does have to win three out of five twice here to take the tournament. So. Dark side. Fighters approaching the Joker's playground. Begin. in again. Just in the back three. That was smart adjustment by Handy Savage. He did uh, take the, um, the adjustment there. It looks like basically whenever he sees a uh, dark side try and go for that uh, follow through into back dash, he just back three. He's got a side of a life lead, but he can't sit back too long here. Uh, dark side will be that will build that meter pretty quick. And take your life quick. Yeah, exactly. So wake up me though. He was late on the meaty setup, so he got caught. Ooh. Doesn't get to confirm, but makes it makes it big city. If you won't kill me, you cannot win. You just watch me. So even So Savage does have uh, a slight meter advantage, but you gotta be careful here. He's really close to getting caught. Oh, wow, nice conversion here. Let's see if it's a clash. It's not. Wow, yeah, wake oh, ups. He's got the whole trait too. Oh, unclashable. Oh, he goes for the air versus oh. the Yeah, that was a quick match there for Handy Savage. So yeah, despite like how um, boring the stage is getting to watch, Andy Savage has managed to to win out on two two times now on the stage with Catwoman against Darkseid. So he's one round away from resetting the back end. We'll have to see if he can uh, pull it off. Wonder Woman. <laughs> Fighters approaching Fortress of Solitude. <laughs> Begin. 
Oops. So they didn't switch in the one woman. And we're seeing we're seeing sunlight. Almost forgot what it looked like. And that whip though. Man, that whip, man, the, the sound of it just like I start having flashbacks. The time I was trying to take some, some candy I wasn't supposed to. <laughs> wake ups. Wow, just does it raw and catches them. Who has the superior whip? We're gonna find out. Has been just quick to use a uh, interactive for sure. Yeah, he, he don't even damn. He using everything. Wow. Good. We'll go for the clash here. Try to keep up. You just watch me. So Henry Davis is doing a really good job of uh, kind of forcing Vengeance to use that clash option kind of early in that second life bar. Wow, the dodge here. Oh, the dodge. Well, he's got full trait too. Oh, air escape. Okay, the life bar is totally the spear, but again, Haney Savage is not afraid to just do it. And he resets the bracket. Catwoman wins. He resets the bracket with the kitty. So, you know, Haney Savage has been using Catwoman the entire tourney. Let's just reset the bracket here and we are on the even playing field. Brainiac. Okay, some, some Brainiac. Fighters approaching Gotham City. I'm here for it. Yeah, I think uh we just see some Brainiac action earlier. It's really tricky, uh Trying to get those conversions, but begin. He has some, some pretty good, uh, you know, pushy options. Like that, look at the range of that there. Yeah, the range is stupid. Got these traps, that dive kick. Just launch himself full screen. Right, nice pickup here from Andy Savage. Build up those scratches pretty quickly. That back three has been working for him so well all night. Wow, low dive pick there. Time to set up. Careful, you might get robbed. It's a pretty solid round for, for Haney Savage there. Got in quick. Wow. Back three right in there. Another early clash here from Perhaps Vengeance. I should collect you. A pleasure you'll never have. That damage is about to lead up. Does he have full, he has full cast crashes too? Oh, boy. Wow. What's going on here? It's like whatever that string is, it's extremely fun to do. And yeah, we were just talking about that trait. Well, here we go. Low dive kick is some like killer instinct stuff, man. Like, so <laughs> that's ridiculous. Get that coming out of here. Yeah, right? Okay. Right, 
absorb that, but here comes the punish. No flash anymore, I have to take all this damage. Wow, that whip! That low whip. Hanny Savage here. He's two games away. Two games away here from uh, pretty much becoming it at all. the week three Fight Club champion. Well, week 10. But Injustice week three Fight Club champion. So we'll see what Vengeance decides to do here. We go back to Dark Side. We go back to one of the other two characters. If you saw uh, Brainiac, we saw some Wonder Woman. The ball is in his court. Cat woman. It's legit all back three and cat dashes. Black I mean, animal. if you have someone constantly backing away from you and doing, and you can lower your hitbox with the attack, then yes, you're going to back three. Prison. Black Adam, which we haven't seen from him uh, today. Yeah, we haven't seen any Black Adam. Actually, no, we did see once. Get it. Begin. There we go. This is what makes it dangerous uh, if you're Catwoman here because uh, Black Island can travel across screen so quickly. Uh, just going from left to right. But if you try and go for something like a, a back there, you can catch you. Alright, nice. Move that claw here. Really good damage there. Just a free mix of good blocks there from the uh, Vengeance. Okay. Yeah, Catwoman's hitbox is definitely helping here. Well, another one. So you you want to wake up? So I got a meaty for you. Careful, you might get robbed. Trade again. And Black Adam, you know, uh, been just seeing all this meter right now. Activate straight. Some quality damage right there. Whip. Smart throw, easy damage. And you see, this is why people get hit by. This is exactly why people get hit by Catwoman right now. Oh, wake up, super! Oh, press the button. And he dodged the interactable with that too. Come Welcome to the Kamazar. Wow, nice oh, easy catch here. Off the interactable, this would be bad right now. Ash, she's got plenty of meter though. I'm stealing this fight. Not in the slightest. Hey! It's gonna be rough now for Vengeance. He can't get touched. Ooh, nice block, but the hitbox. Oh, that whip. That whip. Y'all watch that whip. Welcome back, Zombie. Oh, and Andy Savage is one game away from uh, taking the entire thing. After wrecking his way through the loser side. What will Vengeance do here? We go back to the dark side he's been using most of the night. And we switch it up again. Catwoman. This is turning tournament point here. What will you do? What will you do? It seems like he's pondering right now. Wonder Woman. He's going to one over here. The Diana. Fighters approaching Red Sun Prison. All right, so we'll see if uh, Vengeance can make the adjustments here with Wonder Woman. Uh, you know, she's got uh, plenty of tools. She's got damage. 
good keep away options. As you can see there, shield to the face. Both got that whip action, that lasso. So far, we're gonna have pretty good for him. Until that claw hits you. Right. Good block. Where do you put it back three this time? Boom, boom. Back three. Wow. Damn. Good damage. Yeah, but you can tell he's, he's uh you know he's trying to wait out for that claw attack, but still gets hit by it there. Oh, raw back three. Get the tray oh, activated. Watch feet. Watch Again. Feet. Catches those ankles. Pull the bird in there, get some uh, mix up. Oh, there we go. Let's go. Good damage. Alright, All right, so, so we're just... both in trait territory. I mean, uh, clash territory. Something like gets tricky here. Another back three. No conversion now. Over red and throw. And saw damage. Wakes up. And the start was too slow. Ooh, he gets caught right in mid trait. Four three. Wow. And that's not black. Ooh, God bless. <laughs> <laughs> wow, wake up again. Wake up. She's got meter. In the, the lasso. Whoa, nice blocks. Yeah, I would not contest that air to, that air, to air. Oh, are we teabagging now? Nah, he's pretty probably buffing. Do it. Well, Handy Savage. Takes Week 10 of Fight Club Weekly. Catwoman all the way through here. Catwoman all the way. GG's is everyone involved here. Vengeance for second place. Alright, so another week is in the books. Everyone, thank you guys for all competing. Handy Savage. Don't don't drop your PayPal link in the in the chat, please. Whisper <laughs> one of real. us. Whisper it to one of us. Everybody, you know, top three that that uh, 